right guys what is up review that back here again with another review this time we are doing the Nebo Rebel just uh, picked this thing up this afternoon actually it is a little smaller version of its big brother the big Larry Pro over there um, which I need to do a follow-up review on that but anyway here looking at a 600 lumen LED task light slash headlight comes with the strap which is reflective which that's good uh, let's see box is pretty decent here like like always it's got four different modes turbo mode which only runs for 40 seconds um, high mode runtime for two hours low mode runtime four and a half hours and strobe mode for two hours um, to turn the turbo mode on, as soon as you turn it on, just hold it down, and then the turbo mode comes on, which is pretty overkill. The low mode is pretty much all you need. <laughs> I used the afternoon for a little while, and it seemed pretty good. Um, let's see what else we got here on the box. Um, this is the wireless charging, like the other one over there. Uh, it does have a belt clip, which I clip it on my shirt, so I can go hands-free in my job. So, because most of the time I need both my hands in my job. So, uh, let's uh, crack into this thing here. See what we get in the box. The box feels like an iPhone box. It's really <clears throat> made well. So, uh, yeah, we'll put that out there. And here we go. We got the little light here. It comes already attached to the uh, head strap. And, of course, the wireless charger here. I have had it out when I was using it today. So, uh, and you can do it diff different ways on the head strap. You can go straight up and down or sideways. So, but on your shirt, I mean, I guess you can go up and down if you wanted to. It's just gonna be kind of hard on a hat. So, pull it out here and see what we got here. Got the, uh, set that back there for a second. Just get to the meat and potatoes. Fully reflective elastic head strap. It seems pretty durable. Pull the light here out real quick. Set that to the side for a second. Uh, let's see. It seems pretty durable. It's pretty reflective. I, we can, we'll try it here in a little bit and show you how reflective it is. The little mount is made of rubber. I don't know how over time, I don't know how hold, how that's going to hold up, but we shall see. Set that over to the side here, and we get to the light. Uh, well, here it is. You got your little light grill there. It's that aluminum anodized finish, which is pretty sturdy. Um, we got the same button on the top there for the on-off. That is the normal mode low mode which is pretty bright actually in person so uh and then to hold it down you got turbo mode there and then two quick presses once it's on oh hang on turn it on and then two quick presses to do strobe i don't know what you'd use that for but it's pretty pretty crazy <laughs> and then one press to turn it back off like I said, it does have the wireless charging base on the bottom there. Uh, it does have the little clip for your shirt, which I will be using most of the time. I do have a hard hat. I'm going to show you it all mounted up on the hard hat with the strap. So, uh, I'll do that real quick. One other thing I didn't understand, why it has this label on it. Reproductive harm. I don't understand how a flashlight's going to do that. But anyway, that's California for you. But, uh, we'll, uh, well, hang on a second. We'll finish the box here, I guess. Got the uh, wireless charger here, which I do like. It is longer than the Big Larry Pro one. That thing was short. You can hardly do anything with that. This thing is long. It's, dang it, it's about... Foot and a half, maybe. 
So it's got the little magnetic base there and the uh, little Nebo branding there. Pretty nice little charger. Um, like I said, that one's a little longer than the one that came with that. That one was really short for the car. So uh, we'll get back into that later for that review. I'm going to mount this up on my hard hat and then I'll show you what it looks like. Alright guys, here it is all mounted up on the hard hat here. Uh, sorry, my hard hat is a little banged up. It is used. Uh, it stays on. It, the strap doesn't like to stay down too well. It stays down the front. But it likes to slide up. Maybe it's the way my hard hat is designed. But I mean, I guess I could put it on my head and then put the hard hat on. I can do that too. I don't absolutely have to put on the hard hat, but that's the way it is. That's what it looks like mounted up if you have a hard hat. So, uh, and I did forget one piece of information here on the, uh, on the charging. When you're charging it, it'll light up red on the charger. Right, right there. A little clear section right there will light up red. And when it's done, it'll be blue. I forgot because I uh, just noticed it on the inside of the box here. Right there. Charging is red. Takes about two hours to charge up. So, all right, now I'm gonna, I guess we'll go outside and show you a little bit how bright it is. And then we'll wrap this review up. Okay, this is, uh, we'll just do it in my garage. This is a garage here. I'm running it on the strap on my head. Turn it on normal mode first. That is my workbench there. Some of my tools. I'll pan around here. There's the rest of the stuff. It's, like I said, it lights it up pretty good. That's that's normal mode. We'll go to low mode. Oh, hang on. All right, that's low mode. See how bright that is? That's awesome. That is not the flash on the camera either. So let's go to turbo mode, hold it down, and it goes turbo mode. There we go. There's turbo mode. That is a heck of a difference. That is very bright. So yeah. Then we'll go to strobe mode. That is strobe mode. I'm not going to do that too long because that is trippy. There's that. I'm going to go back to normal mode. There we go. I'm going to get my other little flashlight and show you the difference. As you've just seen, that was the different modes in the pure dark in my garage. Now this is the headlight from Nebo, the Rebel. I'm going to show you my everyday carry, which is my Mini Mag Light Pro. I'll show you the difference. I'm going to turn this one off. Then we're going to turn the mag light on. The beam on the mag light, it's, for one thing, you only get one brightness. And it dies pretty fast. And you have to change batteries. Like I said, you only get so, it'll, it's like the beam is like focused. So that's that. Let's turn the other one back on. See, it floods with more light. See what I'm saying? You get more light. I like that a lot better. So I think we're going to use this one for my everyday carry now. All right, let's get back inside and wrap this thing up. All right, guys, we're back here at the table. So that was my first impression reviews of this thing. Uh, like I said, I've used it maybe a total of about an hour today. But first impressions are very good. Very good. So uh, if you have any questions, just uh, leave them down below there. And if you want to watch the review on the Big Lady Pro, I'll link it up here in the corner. But uh, if you like what you see, hit subscribe, hit the like button. It helps me out. And uh, we'll come back to this in about, mm, let's say a month. And we'll give you a more better, or no, more better. We'll come back to this in a month. And we'll re-review it and see how it's holding up and all that good stuff. So yeah, thanks guys. Later.